Okay, good morning guys. Hi, my name is Madison. Um, I'm new here on YouTube. I make vlogs and lifestyle videos, so you should totally hit the subscribe button and you know, um, like, comment if you want, whatever. Sorry, my hair's bothering me. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna like do a little weekend in my life. It's Saturday already, so like, I don't know. I pretty much work every weekend so for me like the weekend's just like the week if I'm being honest unless I have Sunday off and the Sunday I don't have off so I'm working and it's 4th of July weekend so it's not like gonna be anything like crazy fun if I'm being honest with you I'm gonna be like just doing normal things because I'm working most of the day but I did want to start a vlog. I got my hair done and you should totally um, check out that vlog. I It will be up before this vlog. Um, I didn't vlog the whole process obviously, but I did vlog like you would see my hair before and after and I'm obsessed, like seriously. Um, but yeah, I'm literally about to make my second cup of coffee. A little Whole Foods haul for you, why not? Um, we got mushrooms. We're gonna make like our own little pizzas tonight. So we got mushrooms for the pizza. Mm. My boyfriend Lenny's obsessed with their oatmeal cookies. So did you eat this one already? Look, it looks like someone took a bite of this one. <laughs> I don't know. So he got oatmeal cookies, um, obviously some cold brew. This is like better than Starbucks and I'm not even kidding. Water because I'm gonna be working all day and I know I need to like chill with the plastic but the truth is, is if I don't have a huge water bottle or like a huge gallon of water, I don't drink water. It's just like hard for me. And then, um, I got some kimchi. This is like the best kimchi ever. I know it looks like freaking vomit in a bottle and I don't mean to offend anyone. Like if you like kimchi and you like the way it looks, but like to me, it just looks gross. And I feel like to most people, like look, it kind of does look gross, but honestly it tastes, and I need to say, but stop saying, but honestly, but <laughs> it does taste really, really good. And it's a natural like probiotic because it is, um, it's like fermented, so it's been sitting there for a while. So, I mean, you could like totally Google it. I'm not like by any means a scientist, but I just know if things are fermented. They're really good for your gut and healthy gut means healthy skin. And um, I do like, um, I have acne prone skin. So I just like always am dealing with acne. It's just kind of my like, um, cross to bear so I'm always looking for stuff to help my skin and I used to like when I had the time and <laughs> was like really really when my skin was really really bad basically too um, I incorporated kimchi daily and I did see a difference in my skin along with taking like an actual Lenny can you turn the volume off it's annoying I feel like I have a child but um Anyway, it's actually really good. You could add it to a salad. I you could add it to what tastes really good is if you make coconut rice and add on add this to the top, and it's like actually really really good because it's spicy. Um, and what else did I get? I think that's it. I'm gonna make my little iced coffee. I did change my little recipe. I used to well, okay. I was on a cold brew like black kick for like three seconds. If I'm being honest. And um, now I kind of make an unhealthy drink. It's actually like Alex, I got the idea from Alex Garza, but she like showed how she's making her little iced coffees. And I'm like, oh, that looks so good. It's not by any means like healthy, but it's not horrible for you. It's like better than a latte, obviously. But I use this cold brew like I showed you. I always get two because I'm scared they're gonna like run out. So, some cold brew. I have ice already in there. Um, this is like the best. 
um, cashew milk or like any milk. There's literally all there. There is sugar in it. That's not good. But it's only two grams of sugar. It's not gonna kill me, whatever. I only do a splash too. Cause look, it makes it like decently light. And then I do, this is the naughty part. I do a little bit of the agave, which honestly I've heard different things. Like some people are like, it's basically like cane sugar. And then other people are like, no, it's okay. It's not gonna like, supposedly it doesn't make your, I think it says it on here. I don't know. Something with your like glucose, like, you know, I don't know. Listen, I'm not perfect. I'm uh, trying to be. So if I want a little agave in my freaking cold brew, I'm going to have it. So I'm going to go finish. And it's, it tastes like a latte. Like she was right. This is all Alex Garza, not me. Besides, she adds coconut milk. I like cashew milk better. Um, <laughs> it does look like someone took a bite of the coffee. Of the coffee. <laughs> No. But I'm gonna go finish getting ready because it's literally 9.25. I've sleep in five minutes. And this is the longest intro ever. We're seven minutes into the video. And this is supposed to be my intro. This is what happens to me. Like I literally like can't stop talking. And yeah. So I'm gonna put away the groceries. I'm gonna put a little bit of makeup on and I'll probably see you guys in the car or a little bit later. Okay. So I think it's too bright that way. So honestly, it's Sunday. So I've been a really bad vlogger this weekend. Um, it's probably just gonna be like a day in my life if I'm being honest because today's Sunday and I was gonna vlog the whole weekend. But yesterday, I don't even know what we did. I know we got dinner, like we had salad we're totally like stalking the, UP the ups the post office guy um because i'm waiting for my phone it was supposed to be delivered yesterday but obviously it was fourth of july so nothing was being delivered no i don't think so maybe let's see and and i guess the, uh my phone is not being delivered, which completely sucks. Sometimes it tells them to go all the way that way, though. Alright, thank you. Um, but we're on our way. We're on our way to get Aussie, or how do you say it? Let me stop. How do you say it? Acai. Acai bowls. I can't pronounce it. Um, Aussie. Shut up. So, and then I'm off to the races. I'm going to work, so, um. Yeah, but I'll totally bring you along on yeah, our smoothie no bowl adventure. No, no freaking phone. Don't curse, honey. No phone, so I don't know. I guess we're probably going to miss when it comes. Nah. And I'm going to be back here and literally fall. All right, well, I'm going to see you guys at the smoothie bowl place because you're going to fall and the lighting is going to be awful. So I'll see you at the smoothie bowl little place. YouTube, we'll see you later. I think I told you what day it was. Um, so I'm about to like put together a quick dinner, like really fast. Um, hold on. Sorry. Um, like super, super fast. It's literally the easiest dinner like ever. All it is is mushrooms. I'm using like half an onion, brown rice pasta, and some Rio's marinara sauce and I'll show you like how it comes out and everything but it's literally the easiest thing you'll ever make in your life um hold on one sec 
we always have garlic in everything so we need garlic in here of course i use a i that sounded gross but i use a lot of garlic it's just i don't know we're garlic people but um the simplest dinner ever i kind of made it up on a win like i don't even want to say that i like created this because it's kind of stupid to say that oh and you're gonna need this vegan grilled cheese but it's basically like a baked ziti vibe i don't even like normal baked ziti like i never did as a kid um but i we had to make dinner really fast we had nothing really to make but these ingredients and it's kind of plain to just do like marinara sauce with like mushrooms i mean you could totally do that but like you kind of want to add something else to it um so oh and you know what it was we didn't have a lot of sauce so like if you have a lot of marinara sauce like Rayo's is really flavorful so you could totally just like scratch the big seedy part but we're in the mood for it and it tastes really good so we didn't have a lot of marinara sauce one night and i was like shit like you know we have pasta what are we gonna do and I had the, I had some extra vegan mozzarella cheese from um, like one day when we made pizza. So I was like, oh, I'll just like sprinkle some vegan cheese on the top and put it in the oven. And I did and it came out like freaking, it came out amazing. So that's how it kind of started i mean it's not like revolutionary obviously other people have made um i mean have made what is this big beauty and they've definitely made vegan big beauty before like i got that but um same. so this dinner will probably take like 10 minutes the longest part is gonna be like the water boiling for the pasta I don't know, I'm not even kidding. I need to start that part. So yeah, that's kind of the plan. Well, let me get um little like baking tray thingies. <laughs> and I might as well get the... Turn that on. I think I showed you what pasta I'm using. It's this pasta. This is like the best um, gluten free like alternative to pasta. I hate how my face is out of frame. Sorry. Um, this is like the best alternative to pasta. It's like not mushy, and I don't know. Honestly, I like it better than regular pasta. I'm not like just saying that. So let's go pick some. I put my basil outside because it wasn't doing so well inside and my my plant intuition was telling me to put him outside <laughs> probably sound like a fucking psycho but I just felt like my basil plant was telling me to go like he wanted to be outside so I put him outside hopefully he makes it um I'll go take you outside and show you sounded aggressive see oh he looks like he's doing worse oh no see he's dying that's so sad my boyfriend's gonna kill me because I always make him buy me plants and then I kill them <laughs> so but it's okay whatever I love Basil we'll just hide that from Lenny and turn him around <laughs> so hopefully he doesn't see that Um, my like dream in life. Why are you lopsided? You guys notice that? Oh, there we go. Um, my dream in life is to have like a huge garden. Honestly, my goal is to have like chickens, pigs, 
Um, I, my spirit animal is deer. So a few, a few, um, like bandies would be like cool. Some bunnies. What else? I like sheep. Like sheep are cool. Just like. Oh yeah, like 10 French Bulldogs, obviously. Um, I mean, besides dogs. Like, dogs, like, will probably have, like, 100 of them. But I'm talking, like, farm animals. Like, my dream is to have, like, I don't know. This, like, Malibu, we've Hampton, we Nashville house. That I have this huge backyard. I'm going to manifest this, guys. So I'm putting this all out into the universe. It probably will never happen. But we'll, like, dream about it. Um... And like horses and all these farm animals and like chickens and I don't even eat eggs but we'll like go pick their eggs in the morning. I don't know, milk for freaking cows, okay. I don't drink dairy, but like just like and maybe I'll take like special needs animals in. And like animals that <laughs> you hear my word <laughs> animals that can abused or something and save them, like that's my dream. So it's like afford to take care of all these animals. Um, so yeah. And have a garden. What I was saying is have a garden. And I want to like be able to go pick. Like see how that's like a glimpse <laughs> into what I want my life to be like. I want to like go pick my freaking vegetables for my salad out in my backyard. Like that's goals to me. Like nothing would make me more happy than like having all my fresh garden. Like fresh vegetables in my garden and picking all like my cherry tomatoes and I don't know that's what I want to do when I grow up I want to have my own little farm like seriously I'm not even kidding if you cared if you cared to know what I want my um future I'm gonna do this myself. Oh my god. Haha! <laughs> I'm an independent woman. I swear I feel like whenever I'm able to open like a jar on my own, I like hear the Beyonce song like girls who won this for <laughs> right? I mean anyone else? That's literally what I hear like every time I <laughs> open <laughs> open a sauce jar myself. <laughs> Is that sad that that's me being independent? No, I'm serious. I am independent. Who needs a boy, right? But um, I was actually really hard. I like hurt my hand trying to open that. Okay, while this all cooks a little bit, um, I'll show you what it looks like so far. I mean, this is by no means like um, anything special. It's literally the marinara sauce with some onion and mushroom and fresh basil. But that's what it looks like so far. Um, I'm going to go upstairs, change out of my shorts. Oh yeah, these are the shorts. If you if you saw, like, I put a vlog up, um, that was a while ago that I was going to sell these. These are, um, a Goldie, like the Parker shorts. Um, they are really, really big on me if I'm being, like, I know the style is, like, supposed to be oversized, but... I don't like it like too, like this is like really big, like I don't want them to be tight by any means like on my butt or like on me at all, but I just like, like you guys see that? I just don't like how loose it is, like it's almost like uncomfortable, but I was going to sell them on Poshmark, but <laughs> now I'm like screw it, I don't want to sell it like sell them they're really like expensive shorts like they're not like crazy but they are like over a hundred bucks and um kind of feel like if I sell them I'm only gonna get like 50 bucks for it and it's not even worth it 
so i'm just keeping them maybe i'll give them to my mom or something like we're around the same size but sometimes she could like go bigger than me so maybe i'll like see if she wants them but these are the shorts that i was gonna sell and never did and then i'll give you a little like oh tea. i don't even know how to even say that that's sad i don't know i'll like tell you what my like outfit is from i'm wearing adidas slides i'll wash my hands after touching them a brand new melville my top is from brand new Mel melville like honestly from high school um and then these are the eight goldie parker shorts like i was saying and that's it i mean it's really simple my outfit Now that I washed my hands, I'm gonna go upstairs like I was saying. I'm gonna take my makeup, I'm gonna lower this too. Um, I'm gonna take my makeup off. I'm going to, I'm not even wearing any face makeup. I literally just have SPF and um, some blush. That's what I've been doing on the weekends at work. Just like no like face makeup. And then a little mascara. But I am going to take off the mascara, take off the blush and wash my face. And then I'm going to put on something comfortable just because, like, I want to be really, really comfortable. You know, when you're, like, just need to change your clothes, that's how I feel right now. So I'm going to go do that, and I will see you guys once dinner's probably, like, all ready and finished. Okay, so I just wanted to quickly come on and show you what it looked like all finished. It's, like, clearly just looks like baked CD, but we're going to go eat and walk people lean right and i will talk to you guys in a little bit okay all right guys i just wanted to end my little weekend of my life slash like i don't know a few days um vlog um if you made it this far thanks for watching um i'm a horrible vlogger and i never ended it and i realized that when i was editing all the like different clips i'm like oh my god i never even ended it but um you should totally hit the subscribe button you know like if you want comment if you want and um yeah there's gonna be a ton more vlogs coming this is actually no my my last posted my last video that i posted was my 30th vlog so I, it took me a little more than 30 days to get there but i did post 30 vlogs but i'm just gonna keep posting i think i'm gonna like set up a little schedule for myself and um post like consistently i don't know i kind of really want a daily vlog but i just don't know if like my life and my schedule will allow it if i can like i'm totally gonna but um i'm just gonna kind of figure it out but um yeah i just wanted to say thanks for watching and subscribe if you want to and i'll see you in my next little vlog